Welcome friends. In this tutorial, we will learn about to determine tidal volume and vital capacity. To perform this experiment, you need one balloon and measuring scale. The capacity of the lung is determined by the amount of air which it can hold. Tidal volume is nothing but the amount of air which can be made in and out during normal or quiet respiration. Vital capacity is nothing but the maximum amount of air that can be exhaled out or inhaled in from the lungs. To calculate the tidal volume and vital capacity, first you take the balloon and straight it with pinch so as you get the exact diameter. Now we will calculate the diameter of the balloon to calculate tidal volume. So this has been blown with quite or normal respiration. The diameter, approximate diameter of this balloon is about 6 cm. So we will note it down over here that is 6 cm. And we will mark over here. Now we will calculate the vital capacity that is nothing but the maximum amount of air which can be exhaled out during respiration or from the lungs. So if we can calculate the diameter, it is around 14, 14 centimeter. We will mark over here and we will write down 14 centimeter. Now we will match these areas. The tidal volume is in between the 0 mark and 1000 ml. So it is approximately equal to 500 ml which is quite normal. And the vital capacity has, is 4000 ml. Now we will calculate the vital capacity. You have to take down 3 readings of each tidal volume and vital capacity and calculate the mean and then plot the graph. Now we will calculate the percentage vital capacity of the lungs. The obtained volume of vital capacity is 4000 ml. The expected tidal vital capacity is 4800 ml into 100. Now we will calculate. which is 83.33% anything above 80% is called as normal vital capacity hence friend you have find the percentage of vital capacity hope you will perform it and you will enjoy the video stay home, stay happy, stay healthy, happy learning thank you